Hello everyone, welcome back to No Man's Sky 2.42. We're uh, playing normal mode, doing a playthrough of normal mode. <clears throat> I just swallowed wrong. Today we're going to go get uh, an S-Class Alien Multi-Tool. Uh, if you remember the other day, I found an A-Class Alien Multi-Tool in the space station cabinet of a uh, uh, place I went to. And... Uh, uh, talked to Lava about it, and uh, he spent quite a few days looking for this, so let's go buy it. I uh, also bought, uh, I also spent my nanites. <laughs> I bought the, uh, <laughs> I bought the upgrade modules for it as well. Here we are, Yakimo Station. When we get there, I'll show you the portal address and the location for that. We're also going to build as much of this multi-tool today as we can, so stick around uh, for that part. There we go. Sometimes the teleporter won't let go of me. <laughs> Alrighty. I uh, built a base next to the miner settlement where this multi-tool is located. It's on the planet Nuriku. <laughs> Nuriku. <laughs> it's a weird name. Ah, oh, it's sunny. Nice. We'll see if it's still sunny when we get there. <laughs> Pulled out of that pulse a little soon. <laughs> Whenever you go to buy a multi-tool, it's very important that you uh, turn off multiplayer before you purchase the multi-tool and approach the miner settlement slowly. If you go in there too quickly, it will uh, it has the possibility of changing the multi-tool to a different class. There we go. This multi-tool was uh, found as an A-class in the space station, so there's no need to reload. If, uh, if we'd had to reload on another planet in order to get the multi-tool to appear uh, in the space station, then you would have to reload on that other planet. But in this case, it was found in the space station and so, S-Class Alien Multi-Tool. So it's gonna be right here. And there it is. And we'll go ahead and take a look at it really quickly. It's showing that it has only 602 damage. That number only reflects the, uh, in the installed weapon. If the installed weapon was a scatter blaster or a pulse spitter, for instance, that number would be quite a bit higher. If there's no number or no uh, weapon installed, then it just shows the base stats for the multi-tool. Right. Oh, yeah. Let's go into camera mode. And let's see if I can control my camera. Right down there in the lower right corner, lower left corner even, is the portal address for this planet. You can portal directly to this planet and come to this minor settlement without reloading, no reloading, and buy this multi-tool. If it's not there, then you go to the space station to reload because that's where the multi-tool uh, appeared first. All right. We're going to buy it outright uh, because I don't want to give up this weapon. Uh, I like it. I'm attached to it. <laughs> we'll use it for something else later. So we're just going to go ahead and buy it. Alien multi-tools and experimental multi-tools in S-Class cost 7.5 million units. If you're trading in for another multi-tool, then there'll be a price difference and you'll get something off the price. All right. Let's go outside and I'll give you the location uh, for Xbox people. Turn off that flashlight. 
There we go. And I think I'll turn up my HUD. I do it every time. <laughs> Let's turn the HUD up so you can see. Uh, in the upper right corner, it shows you the location is minus 3 by minus 154.54. And on the left side, it shows you that the planet is Nuri Q. It's a gamma planet. And it's in the Yakimo uh, star system. <laughs> Let's fix that uh, HUD before I forget and we can't fly. <laughs> there we go. Is it normal now? <laughs> All right. Now, in order to... Um, do this multi-tool. You can see here is uh, a uh, com ball from Bitterbeck who came and got the multi-tool. And there's also a com ball from me around here somewhere, but I can't see it. But there's a uh, <laughs> there's also a base computer right there. This is on PC normal, that base computer. All right. Now then, let's go up to the freighter to build this. Because I've got uh, tech modules up there. I think I have a few. Let's see if I can fly between the guns. <laughs> About to dive right into the deck there. <laughs> In the coming days on this save, we're going to be buying frigates, building a small circuit board farm, uh, and we'll start traveling around a little bit. We need to find a ship that I can fly. I tossed around whether or not to uh, improve this ship or buy a new one. That's just a bee. It's a nice looking hauler though. Silly flashlights on again. All right. In here. Uh, nope, it should be right on the freighter. Let's come over here in case I need that thing. So it should be right on the freighter, right there. Uh, we also need uranium. There we go. All right, let's start by giving, getting rid of this stuff. We're going to keep the analysis Pfizer scanner and the mining beam. And I'm just going to start right here and probably have to go buy the scatter blaster. How silly. Let's do the mining beam first. <laughs> Optical drill, we need... Sodium diodes and salt refractors. Let's see if I have any of that kind of stuff around. Probably not. Nope, that's not a diode. I think the first thing we're going to do is go buy some technology. 3,000 nanites. There's sodium diodes. Oh, hello. Picked up some stuff. Calm down, suit lady. <laughs> Have some of those around. And no salt refractors, huh? Hmm. Bugger. Let's go to the anomaly. <laughs> Didn't realize that I hadn't bought the technology yet. I always go down the wrong stairs. Uh, after you buy a, sh buy a couple of ships, uh, your ship's location gets a little more predictable. <laughs> so used to buying uh, this technology so early in game. Of 
What in the world is the matter with you? Why won't... Oh. <laughs> oh, fleet. Planetary interference. All right. Not interfering now, are you? <laughs> now that we're 150,000 units away. <laughs> <laughs> Wasn't planning on it, suit lady. <laughs> I bought a ton of upgrade modules, so I hope I can do this. All right. Go upstairs and buy the, the only technology that I don't have. My feet are sinking through the floor. That's not a good sign. <laughs> oh, it let me through. Woohoo! Here we are. <laughs> Alrighty, we need a scatter blaster. We need the tutorial part of this to stop. We need a shell greaser. Uh, I think I have that not prepared to put on a pulse spitter yet. Righty. How about now? <laughs> Scatter blaster. Gotta go get the pugnium. Good grief. <laughs> Good grief, game. You're driving me crazy today. Jump back to our home base. If anything ever went to plan, I think I would fall off my chair. <laughs> Alrighty, well, we needed a salt refractor anyway. And let's see, zero. Uh, no. There's the. You know what? We'll put those away. There's that. Uh, let's put silicate powder away. Silly powder. Because we need room for the salt refractor. Oh, I forgot to get the Pugnium out. <laughs> Pugnium. Let's build that so that I can put that away. Scatter Blaster. There we go. Finally. <laughs> Shell Greaser. There we go. Uh, scanners, mining beams, scatter blasters. And that one. Does it show how many bullets I have? See, it shows, uh, it actually does show it. It shows that I have 54, and then when you reload it, you only have 48. Ah, I miss having that one extra shot. Oops. I just shot them. <laughs> How many times have I wanted to shoot those guys? <laughs> Alrighty. Oops, right over here. Optical drill. And then we'll grab the mining beams. And then, how do I make that? 
I need one carbon nanotube and one hermetic seal. And we'll drop that right there. Advanced mining beam. All right. Now we need to do the scanner. And up here, uh, I need the waveform recycler. That's uh, 100 magnetized ferrite and an ion battery. And then the hard part, the scanners. I have one extra scanner module. After I bought the scanner modules, I found a scanner module uh, in a damaged machinery. So what do we have here? Garbage, uh, medium garbage, and terrible garbage. So let's see. Let's start with the most garbage one. What's the fun on that? 67, 64. Five. Let's see what this is before I decide that that's what I want to use. Uh, that's quite a bit better. So let's take that one out. And we'll put that one in. We need to buy more scanners because those are pretty terrible. And we have our uh, mining beam set up for optimum, optimal uh, harvesting. And we need to install a survey device, but not right now. Um, I actually do have all that. I think I have a cobalt mirror. Let's see here. Oh, I had more sodium diodes. I forgot. I had to put them away. I didn't have any room. Let's see here. Here's a cobalt mirror. There we go. All right, where do I want to put this thing? Uh, I think I'll put it right there just to get it out of the way. All right. We don't have anything to test this on. Uh, nope. No sentinels around. <laughs> we have a predator, but we'd have to go find one because he's very shy. He lives in the cave. And he's very, very shy. He's a little tiny, uh, little tiny guy. <laughs> As you can see, I've made a couple of changes around here. I installed the site-to-site -site teleporter. Um, this is nothing but frostwort now. And the site-to-site -site teleporter goes down there to another biodome. So when we come back, we're going to be building a biodome uh, farm, a circuit board farm. And for some reason that I don't quite understand, maybe some of you might know, this thing doesn't work. Oops. After I set it down, it works. Here, works now. But when I leave and come back, I can see all the wires. So I'm probably going to have to zip something off the Zen desk about that and try and figure it out. All right, you guys, that's all I had planned for this was just uh, buying this beautiful multi-tool and uh, building it. And uh, I'm going to put a uh, link uh, probably down in the lower uh, left corner there uh, uh, to Lava Lamp 64's uh, YouTube channel and a link to him uh, showing you how to get this multi tool will be in the lower right corner. And I want to thank you all so much for coming along. We will see you for base building day. Uh, that might be later today or it might be tomorrow. I haven't figured it out yet. Have a great day.